Welcome to another Figuring Out Japan video. We sell all the coolest Japanese collectibles and figurines straight out of Japan. And you can find out more details about us in the description of this video, including our Facebook page and our online store. Uh, so I apologize for the poor sound and uh, quality of this video, but I wanted to quickly show you guys uh, this figure. Now sadly I won't be uh, opening and reviewing this because these have to go out to uh, customers. But uh, I wanted to quickly show you guys because uh, some of you may have not even been aware that this figure actually exists. Now with the new, this is tied to the new uh, Dragon Ball Broly, Dragon Ball Super Broly movie. And uh, Van Presto kind of kept it a big secret who the, the new secret character was, uh, which of course was Super Saiyan God uh, Gogeta. I don't know why it was such a big secret because Gogeta's been around for decades, literally, but... Yeah, I guess he's got blue hair. Um, so these were actually announced very, very close to the release of the film. And uh, it actually, this is quite a rare figure because it was only released in uh, Bun uh, Namco Game Centers in Japan. And uh, I don't know what proportion of Game Centers in Japan would be Namco. But if I had to take a wild guess, I'd say it's probably around 20 to 25 percent. And that kind of matches up with the prices that I've seen these go for in Japan, which is about four to five times the price of what they would go for, what normal standard figures actually go for. Um, due to the, you know, it's four or five times rarer, therefore it's, you know, four or five times the price. But these are pretty cool. Uh, they're very big actually, they are, um, they're, they're actually the same size as the Grandista figures, as you can see. So they are quite big, and they're certainly quite heavy, and, uh, yeah. Now there are actually three different versions of this. So you've got the, uh, the, the standard God Gogeta, then the Super Saiyan Gogeta was, I believe, only available at J-World. So this one's actually even rarer. And then this one is even rarer again. And I think this one was available on uh, like online uh, crane game for Namco. Which is a bit cheeky actually, Ben Presto. Because Ben Presto is owned by Bandai Namco Holdings. So <laughs> it's a bit cheeky that they re release these figures like exclusively available, you know, at Namco places. But anyway, that's what they did. So this one is actually really super rare and expensive and then this one's kind of in the middle and this one's the the standard one uh, which is good because this is probably the one that what what most people want but as i said it is still a limited release so even this one is rarer than uh standard figures now the other thing i wanted to just point out before i end the video is that this is not related to the ultimate soldiers figure uh which has four figures in that line so you've got broly Goku, or God, Goku, God, Vegeta, and uh, God, Gogeta. Now, as of the time of this video, these three have been released. This one hasn't. This one comes out in January. So, this is actually a different release. It's not part of this particular uh, line of figures. Uh, now, it's, it doesn't really have an official name, but colloquially, it's known as the Chor Kamehameha figure, which is the Super Kamehameha figure. Um, so yeah, that's what I guess you could refer to it as. Uh, but this one, the, the Goji one from this one kind of looks like this actually, but in reverse. So he's got, I believe he's got his left hand outstretched in a kind of battle pose. But, uh, anyway, I just thought I'd quickly show you guys. Um, we do still have this available on our store. Um, but sadly, uh, yeah, it's already, you know, the price has increased. Uh, I know some people did. Uh, get pre-order which is nice because uh, some of our loyal customers got a really good price on this and uh, yeah it just shows you know it is worth trying to keep up to date you know check out our Facebook page um, Instagram and uh, online store to uh, you know to, to yeah not miss out basically so uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video